Hello everyone, my name is Chef Tyrone. I am both the leader and the creator of Oishi FC LLC. And uh, I wanted to use this opportunity to um, basically just tell you guys what this business is about, what my product is, what are my goals for the future, and uh, why you should care about any of it. I'll start off with just a little personal background. Born and raised in Ohio. I uh, had a passion for cooking since I was about seven years old, uh, cooking for all of my brothers and sisters. Uh, ran a cooking channel called Fan Two Cents for a little while that did relatively decently, but probably could have done a lot better if I consistently uploaded it, but that's a whole another story in itself. Um, I recently graduated from culinary school and um, yeah, cooking has just been my passion for as long as I can remember. And um, finally decided to get off my butt and start on this business venture, which has evolved quite a bit over time. Um, and if you guys want to really know how we got here, I can give you a little background on that also. So when I was told to come up with my business concept during school, uh, it didn't take me very long to figure out what I wanted to do because I had always had this kind of vision in my mind about what kind of business I wanted to make and what kind of food I wanted to make. And I was always really inspired by those. Um, if you ever see those YouTube videos, you'll see those Korean vendors or uh, vendors in um, a lot of Asian countries where they do fried chicken and they have these big giant stalls. Well, maybe not giant, but um, relatively decent sized stalls. And they got these huge kettles and they're just making tons and tons and tons and boxes and boxes of chicken and it just it just looked like something that I would definitely want to at least experience in my life like I always see those places and I'm like it sucks that I'll never be able to really experience something like that because it seems like you know these places have a really good product um, and it, it always just looks so appealing and they have uh, all these different kinds of sauces and everything and it really really just I don't know man it activated something in me the first time I saw one of those videos like that's if I if I ever opened a food business this is what I would want it to be and um, my initial thought process was to do my best to try to replicate that or to create something like that here in the US which is a lot easier said than done um, as I found out <laughs> trying to pursue this business venture uh, eventually, after hitting wall after wall after wall and realizing all of the kind of hurdles you would have to hit in order to make something like this work, uh, I eventually settled on at least putting out some kind of product that would create ease of use in the kitchen because uh, I'm really big on just kind of streamlining and making processes that are traditionally a little more complicated, much more simplified because... I'm one of those people that really thinks that everybody should experience the joys of cooking and uh, I talk to so many people who don't know how to cook or don't want to learn how to cook. And, uh, you know, I, I feel like it would be a good thing for everybody to know. And uh, making it accessible is very important to me um, and is usually the barrier that keeps people out of the kitchen. So I wanted to create a product that can make things very easy and streamline the process. Frying can be one of those really tedious things. Uh, seasoning fried chicken and stuff can involve quite a few different ingredients and various amounts and a lot of trial and error. And I really wanted to kind of eliminate that and just make it very simple by uh, creating my seasoned flour mix where you don't even have to season the chicken or anything. Uh, you can just use the flour and the chicken. There's no need for any other seasonings or anything like that. And uh, just to kind of streamline the process and take, you know, all those extra steps out of the process and make it easier and more approachable for people. And that's kind of where I went uh, as far as the direction of my product goes. Um, the flour mixtures aren't the only thing that I'm looking into. Obviously, I want to branch out and do significantly more, um, like creating uh, spice mixtures and stuff like that. And my vision, my goal for the restaurant and the place that I want to build um, 
it's still the same. It hasn't changed, uh, but the road to get there is a lot tougher than I thought. So, you know, stepping stones. This is where I decided to start. And um, I think I think I've got a really good product here. Pre-orders are now available over on OishiFC.com. Uh, you can get either original or spicy. We did do a test run uh, during the beginning with lemon pepper. Not quite thrilled about that one yet. And if I'm not 100% happy with the product, I can't in good faith sell it. So until I'm happy with the results of that one, you know, I think I'll just shelf it until I feel better about it. But yeah, um, that's just a little background on me and my business and how we started. Unfortunately, I'm not the, uh, the only thing I'm good at is cooking, really. Uh, video editing, writing scripts, talking publicly, um, and almost everything else, every other skill you need to be a business owner on the internet, uh, I'm just terrible at. So please bear with me if this video isn't I don't know acceptable, but I'm doing the best that I can here with the lack of skills and talent that I have so uh, Check out the website pre-order if you are so inclined and uh, If you know anybody else who'd like to try the product, please share it with them because uh, We want to make this thing grow obviously and uh, I have a lot more plans uh, for the future and uh, growing of this business so uh, hopefully you guys enjoy the product and uh, thank you for listening